Hey guys, welcome to a NJ Croce Batman Classic TV Series Bendable Figures Review. We got some, some of the keychains here, um, some of the 6 inch figures, and also some of the upcoming figures that are going to be released, as, long, and as well as the uh, 124 scale Batmobile. I just want to say these really display nicely uh, on a shelf or with your Batman Blu-ray DVD or you know if you have some sort of a display these are really great throwback to the time you know the 66 to early 70s when these kind of figures were popular the bendable figures like Gumby and, and such and um, so these are really cool nice throwback we have some some of the keychains which we have the Batmobile the classic TV Batmobile designed by George Barris Again, N.J. Croce, and um, it says collect all the Batman TV series bendables, Batman, Robin, the Joker, the Penguin, Catwoman, and the Batmobile keychain, and more. So these are really cool. They really display well. You can peg them, hang them up. Batman and Robin here. These are, uh, it looks like they're about three inch. With a nice hefty keychain on them. And uh, we have some of the six inch figures here. We have the Penguin, Robin, Batman, Catwoman, the Joker. These are really cool. Like I said, they display really nice. And it um, says the box set includes all of your favorite characters from the classic TV series. Look for the Batmobile keychains too. Like I just showed you, I have some of the upcoming figures. The Riddler and Batgirl. And uh, we're gonna check these things out. These look cool. See Batgirl's costume is kind of a sparkly purple, like in the show. Then we have the 124 scale, about 10 inch long Batmobile with um, the bendable figures that says they're stationed um, for, for sitting. So they'll be a little different than, than the keychain. They actually be, stay in a sitting position. Very cool. And it says 124 scale, 9 and a quarter inches long. And it says includes Batman and Robin 3 inch figures in a sitting position. Detailed paint job, no assembly required for display only, non rolling wheels. Some people might not like the non rolling wheels, but due to licensing agreements and such, in this scale it had to be non rolling wheels, from what I understand. And so, which is great for display. If you're going to display this, you don't have to worry about rolling around. So, we'll get some of these opened up and then uh, we'll check them out in a little bit. Stay tuned. And we're back. I got them open. Here with NJ Croce Batman Classic TV Series Bendable Figures. We have the 6 inch bendable figures, the um, 124 scale Batmobile with figures inside, and the keychains. So I'll start with these six inch figures. I think they look great. They look really fun. They look really um, like something that would have been out in the late 60s, early 70s, like you know the Gumby figures and, and such. So let's take a look at some of these. Here's the Joker, Cesar Romero Joker. Very fun looking, nice um, sculpt and everything. These are meant to be just, you know, fun toys. They're not super detailed as you can see in the face you can only get so detailed with this type of figure but they come really neat I love how they look in the packaging you know they most of them these they all bend in the arms the head bends a little bit there this Joker has a very thick waist so he, he's not bending too much there the legs bend a little okay and here's Catwoman I'm guessing it's supposed to be a Julie Newmar's Catwoman Very fun. Bends, arm, head, legs. Her torso bends a little bit. There. You got her Catwoman boots. Okay. Then we have Adam West Batman. Now he has a cloth cape. 
very reminiscent of some of these towels and stuff I've seen. And um, he has his bat symbol there, his gold belt buckle with the yellow utility belt. And um, a lot of people were worried about these when they saw the image when they came out that they didn't have capes on. Well, they do have capes and they're not a hard rubber, they're not sculpted, they're actually a cloth cape. I would say these would be very fragile if they are ages three and up. Um, the, it could probably be easily pulled off. If you can see that, how they're attached there by two little edges there. I'd almost reinforce it with some glue if you were giving it to a very young child. Especially if they were very destructive with their toys. Batman can wave. Hi guys! Okay, and then we have Robin the Boy Wonder. All these nice colors, everything. Even I love the shoes. And again, he has his cloth cape there. Nice chest symbol. Surprisingly, it looks very much like like Burt Ward. So that's really cool. Batgirl. Yvonne Craig's Batgirl here. She has a glossy, a glittery, if you can see it in the video or not. His glitter in her paint and her suit there. And um, I love how they were accurate with the cape. They have the purple on the outside and the yellow for Batgirl. And, woo, getting windy out here. So there she is. This is one of the first figures of Batgirl that I, I know of that's out now. So these will these will be out pretty soon, I believe. Um, all these are out now. You can check out um, you know, like Entertainment Earth and uh, toy companies like that. And um, I don't, Batgirl's not for sale yet, but she will be soon. Then the Penguin was part of the uh, the uh, five pack here. You can also get all these individually carded, and carded uh, the carded figures. Burgess Meredith Penguin, very cool. I like his pants. Looks very nice. Can kind of wave. Still, his head's a little flexible. Nice. I like these a lot. And last, but not least, with the six inch figures here, we have the Riddler. Frank Gorshin's the Riddler. And you notice he has his mask off. Some people were kind of like, well, I'd rather his mask be on. But you know, mostly in the show, I love the uh, detail there. In the show, he usually has his mask off. It's how you usually see him. So it's kind of unique that they had him this way. But the question marks look great. Detail on there. So, these are looking really cool. Next we have the keychains. Here's the Batmobile keychain. Even has the detail on the bottom, which I thought was a nice extra touch. Very durable. They're not bendable. At least the Batmobile is not bendable. It's very like a durable rubber. You can see it kind of bends a little bit, but it's very, very durable feeling. Nice, sturdy keychain there. And we have Batman and Robin. These are about three inch, three inches tall. Really nice detail. Now these capes are sculpted on. They would just rip off if they were on a keychain. And they these are bendable. The figures here are bendable. The legs and everything. Pretty nice. I like that. Very nice durable keychain with it also. You can have the clip or just the key ring on it. This is very cool. The Batmobile. George Barris Batmobile. And we have these the figures inside there. This is 124 scale. Very nice. Detail on the bottom. And again, these the wheels do not rotate, which um, for display purposes, that's great. If you're gonna give it to a little kid or something, I mean, it would still scoot on on um, slick surface, but uh, for a display, this is really nice. I really like it. it. Looks really great. Really good detail.
And uh, yeah, it's about 10 inches long. Even has the license plate number on there. The 2F3567 and Gotham 1966. The parachute's there. And uh, you'll notice the pipes are a little bit bendable. Now the figures in here, they can come out. They just pull out. They actually have seat belts on in there. And these are... These don't seem to be the bendable figures. At least in the legs. And they are bent so that... Um, you can see they're sitting. But it looks... The arms... The head are bendable. And I didn't really look and see if that unplugs. I'm probably just going to leave it there. It looks like they, they will slip right back in. Yeah. Okay, looks like that did unplug. Okay, so it... Okay, there's a tiny slot in there. The detail in these are fantastic. They even have, I mean, the lights on there, the uh, bat phone, everything, the fire extinguisher with the bat symbol on there and everything. And then here's the, the Batman figure. Again, he can bend in the arms and the head. The legs are not bendable. And you can't bend back their... Um, legs so I mean they're meant to be for display inside the Batmobile very nice I like this very much I like this scale and um, won't take up too awful much space on your shelf for display so that is the NJ Croce Batman Classic TV Series Bendable Figures. I hope you guys enjoyed the review. If you can, um, give me a thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you like. And um, stay tuned.